en question. Le Président, veuillez vous asseoir. Le Président, please be seated. The court is now in session. During today's sessions, the chamber continues to hear the testimony of civil party Lai Bouni. The chamber wishes to also inform the co-lawyers for the civil parties and Mrs. Lai Boni, that uh, when putting questions Lai and Boni responding to the questions, uh, et ceci vaut make sure you observe some pause so that il convient de marquer une pause the interpreters entre les questions could et les render réponses, the message fully because yesterday you were rather fast. Court correction is now instructed to report on the attendance of the parties to the proceedings de faire today. Sur la présence des parties à l'audience. Good morning, Mr. President. All parties to the proceedings are Merci, present. Le Président. Toutes les parties uh, sont présentes, sauf M. Yang Sari. Il est absent reason. pour raison de santé. According to document E237, the accused person has en application his du document E237, right L'accusé a renoncé à son droit d'être présent and pour la déposition de cette partie civile et pour celle du témoin Mr. de réserve TCW 362. Maître Arthur Verken est absent car il est pris par des obligations personnelles. TCW 362 is Le témoin ready TCW 362 est prêt room and il est dans la salle d'attente prêt à the witness best recollection and knowledge, the witness has nothing or has no related uh, relation or blood relation to relation any of the parties to the proceedings, including the accused persons. Avec this witness will be assisted uh, by uh, jury counsel, Mr. Lim Bunheng. The president, uh, thank Lim you. Bunheng. We would like to hand over to the lawyers Merci. for the civil parties La parole to va proceed. Être donnée aux avocats des parties civiles. Council Savanari. Thank you, Mr. President, Maître Your Honours, and Mok very Sovanari. good morning to you, Madame Civil Party. Bonjour Yesterday et bonjour we vous, left off civile. when Hier, you were evacuated to Kandal de votre and Badambang. Today I would like to continue putting a few more questions concerning this evacuation. Could you please be more precise on when exactly you were transferred from Kandal? À quel moment exactement avez-vous été transféré depuis Kandal? A response. Very good morning, Your Honours. Réponse. At that time, Bonjour. I do not recollect the exact date, but it is most likely Je me souviens pas de la date in exacte, May. Mais très probablement au mois de May. The rain started to fall heavily already. It was the farming la pluie season, avait déjà commencé and à tomber. I was transplanting the rice du when I was asked je to pack my luggage so that I could be transferred to Batambang. Parce que être vers Batambang. Question. question. I will refer to the same question as I did yesterday and with Mr. President's leave I voted document to be je put up on the screen. Document in Khmer ERN 0037-3249, English ERN 0037-9159. And French ERN 00 42 24 51 through 52. 
stated before the investigating judges that you were taken by an ox cart uh, to the riverbank before you boarded uh, a boat uh, to Badenbaum and then you were transported by the Chinese military truck. Dans un camion militaire chinois. My next question is when Voici you question. reached the river bank, uh, how many rivière, boats did you see coming to pick up the people? De bateaux avez -vous vu embarquer la population? Response. Through the ox cart, uh, indeed, when I reached uh, the river banks, I saw three rivière, ships, big vessels, the ship that could accommodate a few hundred people, and we were asked personnes. to load our luggage on onto the ships immediately because we had to rush uh, to affaires. make sure we Car got to Kampong Chenang before Kampong the Chenang. sun set. Avant le crépuscule. Question. Can we Question. ask you please uh, how many people were boarding each ship at that time? Combien de gens y avait-il à bord de chaque bateau? Response. Réponse. Uh, there were not a lot of people. It was not very crowded because people uh, could uh, lie down Les gens if they wished. Pouvaient s'allonger s'ils le voulaient. Question. Question. How many people approximately were there on the board of uh, the dock of the ship that you're boarding? Combien de gens y avait-il environ dans le bateau less than a hundred people all together? Réponse. Moins de 100 personnes. Question. Were all the evacuees uh, from Sakandal district or from elsewhere? Les évacués venaient-ils tous de Sakandal? Response. De ce district là ou bien All the evacuees uh, were from tous les évacués Sakandal district, du district de Ksakandal. indeed from different communes and villages. Mais de communes et de villages différents. Question. You just mentioned Question. that when you were on board the ship uh, you saw the Khmer Rouge soldiers bateau, who were armed vous avez and vu who des soldats Khmer Rouge uh, qui étaient armés. you onto the ship. Uh, so do you know who, where these soldiers were from? Savez-vous d'où venaient ces soldats? Response. I do not know where these Réponse. soldiers were from, Je ne sais pas but I know that they soldats. were from the zone. Mais je savais qu'ils venaient des zones. Question. I would like uh, to go back to your record of interview Question. on je vous renvoie e, uh, an in Khmer 00 English ERN 00 9160 French ERN 00 2452 In that portion you said that you were sent to what Kochum in Bosat, and that the ox cart was seen poised to que vous avez vu transport the people to other locations. Des gens et My des question arrière. is, who prepared la the ox cart to Qui receive the people? Ces à pour la Response. I Réponse. have no idea who 
made uh, all these arrangements. Je ne sais pas qui But a uh, after pris asking a few questions uh, to other villagers, I learned that the Oscars were from different cooperatives from sector 22 and sector 23, for example. And I asked them where the Oscars uh, could have been from. Some would say they were from Kandin location, and they asked Kandine. us where we would like to go or where we would like to go to Kandin or not, and I said si I had no idea. Aller à Kandine ou non, et moi j'ai dit que je n'en savais rien. Question: When the Khmer Rouge countries in Sakandal asked you Question. to leave the area, you were told that you would be transferred to Batambang, where food was plentiful. Où il y avait abondance de nourriture. Et quand vous avez été transféré vers Poussat, did the Khmer Rouge keep their word uh, by transferring you all the way to Batambang as they promised? Les Khmer Rouge ont tenu parole et vous ont transféré jusqu'à Batambang comme promis. Response. Indeed, they Réponse. did not honor their promise. Ils n'ont pas tenu parole. I believe that uh, they only used that as a pretext to make sure we could be un moved from the location more immediately. Plus and uh, I don't believe that they care so much about failing to honor their promise. Je ne pense pas qu'il leur importait beaucoup de tenir parole. Question. At the cooperative Question. at Posat, Province, did you dans have enough food, or was the food plentiful, as they say? Y avait-il assez à manger? La nourriture était-elle abondante, comme il l'avait dit? Response. Réponse. During the Khmer Rouge regime, from the beginning Sous when I left Phnom Penh, Rouge, à compter du début. Quand whenever Phnom the Penh, harvest, rather, whenever the trend, a uh, rice trend transplant season came it was the Dès most arrivait la saison du repiquage du riz uh, difficult time concerning food la période so we did not have food uh, to eat in particular during the rainy uh, the farming season but i could manage to bring la saison along du some travail agricole uh, food stuff mais so j'ai pu emmener avec moi des denrées alimentaires qui m'ont permis de survivre Question. What Question. was your impression concerning the livelihood of the evacuees and other Quelle people? Did you notice that these people were given enough food des to eat? Et des autres, avez-vous eu l'impression que ces gens recevaient assez à manger? Response. At the Kochum Cooperative, à la cooperative I only Kochum, learned about people in my neighboring village. Au courant que de la and uh, the people in that village des had uh, to village voisin, clear dans ce village, the bamboo les gens tree so that they could uh, make a village. And the Pour the evacuees des in uh, this uh, village uh, all died. Uh, sometimes village, in the whole family, none last member of the family mort. survived because of the ordeal. Des familles entières ont été complètement décimées à cause des conditions de vie pénibles. Question: I th will conclude uh, this point uh, by asking you this question. question. When the evacuees point, were transported or transferred to the location, how were they treated? Transferred vers leur destination, comment ont-ils été traités? Response: At that time, there was Réponse. no special treatment. We were made uh, to form groups eating nous communally, nous en like groupe, four cans of rice uh, les for en commun, a few people, avec quatre and boîtes de riz the people à would be tasked uh, with uh, working 
à différentes locations. Les gens se voyaient Mais confiés aux différents endroits. We were not offered, uh, quand quelqu'un tombait malade, ils ne recevaient was, aucun médicament um, et la nourriture short. elle-même manquait. Question. This is the last uh, question, question to you. J'en viens à ma um, dernière question. Have you observed or what was your observation concerning the transfer of the people from du transfert Phnom Penh to Bakan district in Bhutan? Do you Bacan believe that such a policy was friendly enough to the people who were evacuated? Politique était bienveillante Response. envers les évacués. I personally feel that if they Réponse. were to treat us well, to bring us all the food supplies they wanted, I do not feel there would be any short supplies of food because uh, s'ils avaient voulu there donner à ces gens, il n'y aurait pas eu de pénurie. Available. Il y avait However, de the Phnom Penh dwellers who Mais were then the evacuees were de destined for being tempered mainly and they did not care whether we died or not. They just wanted to, uh, to make sure we Got eux tempered. se moquaient de savoir Council. si nous allions mourir ou non. Ils Thank voulaient you very simplement much, uh, nous rééduquer. Merci beaucoup, Mme Subopati, pour vos réponses à ma question. Et je remercie Mme Bencher d'avoir répondu à mes questions. Je remercie également la Chambre de m'avoir permis d'interroger cette participante. Je vais donner la parole à ma consoeur Maître Elisabeth Simonofor. Le président du Conseil, le président du Conseil, le président du Conseil. Maître Simonofort, je vous en prie. Bonjour, Monsieur le Président. Good bonjour, morning, Mesdames Mr. et Messieurs les Juges. Uh, bonjour morning, à tous. Honors, good morning to all of you. Et bonjour à vous, good Madame, morning, uh, à qui je vais poser maintenant quelques questions. Je vais revenir I un petit peu like sur, euh, sur le, le premier the transfert, first, uh, transfer, le premier déplacement de personnes dont vous avez été euh, évacuées uh, à partir de Phnom Penh. Vous nous avez and expliqué donc, us, euh, votre trajet, combien de temps, uh, en gros, avec les arrêts à plusieurs endroits, combien de temps a duré ce premier voyage How long did this first journey last? Response. I cannot recollect this precisely, but I left on the 17th of April, and after a few stops, uh, we reached Ksakandal district by um, late. Nous sommes arrivés dans ce district. Rather by. Uh, by the end of the Khmer New Year, so I can say it took us approximately one month for the trip. Ça a donc pris environ un mois pour faire ce voyage. Je vous remercie. Thank you. Vous avez euh, décrit you un peu ce qui se passait sur la route, uh, notamment pour votre famille, road, parmi les gens qui marchaient. Qu'arrivait-il à ceux qui ne pouvaient pas continuer who, le chemin what, what happened to those who could not keep up with the journey, who could not uh, continue uh, For people who could not continue their journey, like the Les gens qui people who had just route, left uh, the hospital, par exemple, they would be pushed uh, by se a wheeled uh, hospital bed, or they would be carried uh, in stretcher or ou encore hammocks. ils étaient transportés dans des hamacs ou des brancards. Ceux qui étaient gravement malades on somebody's bank, uh, while walking. étaient également transportés de cette manière. 
restés au bord de la route Did, uh, Yes, uh, there were women who were giving oui. birth Il y avait des to the babies and we Qui could hear them crying out loud in pain Nous when they were about les to cris de douleur give birth de ces femmes to en travail. the babies and we would be crying asking for any midwives uh, who would uh, be able to help uh, give birth de uh, to the child une then uh, later on we could find an senior midwife who could uh, une like uh, help uh, the woman the woman delivering the babies son assistance à cette femme en travail. Je vais venir maintenant au lieu où vous vous êtes arrêté quelques mois, qui s'appelle Anne Chengley. Pardon pour ma prononciation. Vous avez expliqué que dans ce lieu, il y avait des réunions auxquelles vous alliez. Est-ce que pendant ces réunions, on vous a donné des informations sur ce qui se passait dans le pays, sur la politique nationale In Ancheng Le village, Au village Le, I attended livelihood meetings. I also engaged in carrying banana trees. After giving birth aussi to des my child for 20 days, I reached that uh, village. And because I fear I would be killed, jours, I had village, to engage in carrying big, heavy banana trees. I did not have the gut to even tell uh, the people that I had just delivered the, the baby. I had to work and carry heavy loads. However, in the meetings, uh, we were not told uh, anything Lourdes. about the policy or of the ANCA rather than teaching us or lecturing us on how to build canals, digging dikes, and how to canaux, uh, comply with barrages, the uh, plan of the ANCA. Et on nous a dit de quelle manière nous devions exécuter les plans de l'ANCAR. Merci. Est-ce qu'il est arrivé qu'on vous fasse you. écouter des discours des hommes Were politiques Were you obliged to listen to speeches at times, speeches by political figures At that time, I did not have an opportunity to listen to any of the speeches. Je n'ai entendu aucun discours à l'époque. Merci. Thank you. Vous avez plusieurs fois évoqué you hier often et, said to us yesterday, devant le juge d'instruction aussi le fait qu'on vous surnommait le peuple du 17 avril uh, ou le peuple nouveau et vous avez parlé aussi du peuple de base. Est-ce que vous pouvez nous dire uh, quelles étaient les différences so entre ces so deux catégories, catégories de population dans la vie quotidienne, dans le traitement habituel, dans le travail, dans, etc. Response. The old people and the new people were different. The old people had been living in the community for a very long time. They had their own belongings, property, they had their uh, household utensils and ready for use. But for the 17th 
of April people, they were new people and evacuees. They were told by Anka that they would be leaving the city for three days because uh, they had to. We had to leave before the bombs would be dropped on us. So we left with nothing. We were from the worker-class family. We never. Oh, this business people. We never got used to farming, chopping small trees to clear way for paddy fields. Familles. So Nous we had to make the most of it. For example, we would take the advantage of having our brought along belongings and things to exchange with things that we needed, Ceux for example, we would uh, objets, exchange some belongings contre, for knives or uh, other kitchen utensils. And we did cuisine, not couteaux, do very well uh, in performing our farming tasks Nous and we were accused of being uh, not skilled or uh, being passive. The old people passifs. in the base actually got used to the work. They could base, do things much faster than we did. Uh, for example, même. when it comes to farming, the old people pour could take a few hours to finish the whole paddy field when farming. But we had to really spend much more time than that because rizière. we did nous, get, nous not get used to doing it. De plus de temps, c'est parce que nous n'étions pas habitués. Est-ce que le peuple nouveau était respecté par les Khmer Rouges comme were le peuple de base ou est-ce qu'il y avait une différence Were the just as the base people or was there a difference Response Indeed, uh, new people were not treated equally as they did to the old people because the old les people uh, had already built their themselves, so it is the construit. new people who had to build themselves and be newcomers. Des de se Je vous remercie. Thank you. Vous nous avez dit hier que Yesterday votre you told fille, us that Vonida, your daughter avait été malade sur le chemin pendant le transfert de population during the journey when people were mangé, evacuated because qu'elle avait faim du maïs décortiqué. Qu'est-il arrivé à votre fille? That was spoiled. And what happened to your daughter? When we reached Sakandal, my daughter, who had been ill for a few days already, she had uh, severe diarrhea, and uh, we did not have enough medicine uh, for her treatment. I was asked uh, to pick up some leaves uh, to, for her to treat her illness. And every one member of our family got ill. We got fever and high temperature. And uh, my aunt, who lived Notre in the Hiesu commune, who paid a visit uh, to us, when she saw visite. this, she would Et like uh, to take my daughter état, to live with her so that she could be treated, uh, elle, because she believed soins. that when a member of the family is sick uh, and if she allowed to be among the family, uh, then everyone could uh, get infected. Uh, so with that uh, uh, offer, I also agreed uh, to let her go. A few days later, Je I believed partir. that my daughter would be properly treated or well taken care of, tard, but only to learn so that she died when being there. Bien la fille, mais appris en fait elle était morte quand elle était Quel âge avait votre fille, madame How old was your daughter, madam? Uh, 
Response. Réponse. She was uh, five years Elle old. Cinq She was born by late 1971. Elle est née à la fin de Dans ce premier lieu, vous avez vécu quelques mois. Est-ce que vous avez vu ou est-ce que vous avez entendu parler de disparition ou d'arrestation Response. I heard about this. Before I were made to live in a private house, uh, Assigned by the Khmer Rouge, I lived with comrade John with a few families, and I was asked to conceal my identity. I was asked to really keep this secret. I was told to tell people that I was a taxi driver or just Food stuff on a suggéré vendor. de dire aux gens que notre famille était and chauffeur de taxi uh, ou vendeur de nourriture. A lot of people who knew um, one of the family members because he went uh, there on several occasions was reported. And une personne Later on, we learned that he Un membre de la famille qui se rendait là souvent a été euh, I don't dé remember the name dénoncé. of that person. Il a disparu, je ne me souviens pas de Because nom de cette personne. his uh, identity was uh, identité somehow revealed. And the, from that incident, we were told that uh, we had to be prepared. Après cet incident, For example, if we had a male member in the family, exemple, we had to be ready, for example, packing our luggage. If we were called, then we would be ready to go and leave. Fortunately, none of my family member would disappear after that. Après cela, personne dans ma famille n'a disparu. Est-ce que quand quelqu'un disparaissait, on vous donnait ensuite des When explications sur cette disparition Were you then given any kind of explanation about the disappearance? Response. I was not told uh, about this. The, 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 we only learned that uh, the person was taken to work at su, other location. We had no nerve, actually, to or strength to ask uh, people what happened to a person who disappeared. I want to thank you. Next, you were displaced then once again. You were told that you were going to Batambang, and in fact, you were able to Pursa. What was the physical condition for the uh, 17th of April people when they were displaced a second time? Response. I myself was sick because during the day of the evacuation, uh, a few days before that, I uh, were transplanting potatoes uh, at my uh, in my backyard, and at that time, because we had to be evacuated, I had to make use of the potatoes that we planted uh, so that we could eat on the road. But uh, the food stuff that we had to eat on the road didn't do any good to us. It was uh, bad to our stomach. Mais la nourriture que nous avons mangé en chemin en fait nous n'arrivions pas à la digérer. Mais en général, les gens qui ont été déplacés yes, avec vous, tous les gens, est-ce qu'ils étaient en bonne forme physique physical shape Dans quelle forme physique étaient-ils quand uh, ils ont été déplacés kind of, uh, health status did they have when they were being displaced Response. 
uh, early second. days during the evacuation, the, our physical and health condition Au was début, uh, normal. We normal. still looked good, and we could bring along with us some belongings. Ça we could have them exchanged uh, with some rice des effets que nous to contre du riz store for future que nous supplies. In Posat, uh, I could manage uh, to keep some of uh, these uh, rice uh, we could have traded uh, with uh, other people. So we still looked uh, reasonably Donc, normal. However, normal. when time passed Mais by, we did not temps. have enough food to eat. We Nous ate the food uh, that uh, was uh, very little. We ate uh, food that uh, made us become, you know, the, our body parts become swollen. And we believe at that time we noted that the pigs uh, were even membres. given more Et food than Uh, that they gave to et on human a remarqué being. que d'ailleurs on donnait souvent plus de nourriture ou parfois plus de nourriture aux porcs qu'aux humains. Je vous remercie. Après ce deuxième Thank déplacement, vous êtes arrivé à Kochum. Est-ce que vous pouvez nous dire, Madame, ce qui est arrivé Madame, à votre fils Sinarit Response. At Kochum Cooperative, we were put into different groups, and with the belongings I brought with me, I could have them traded uh, with some sticks and poles so that uh, we could uh, make our makeshift uh, shelter. And um, my mother and brothers and my remaining son still stays with me, but we had to work uh, very hard. Uh, we did nothing but concentrate on farming. And uh, in the evenings, uh, we would uh, attend meetings, livelihood meetings. And I was criticized uh, for not uh, efficiently Before my task, I was uh, in Phnom Penh before, and I got married Avant with a high-ranking officer, and I did not know how to do this hard work before. And in the cooperative, I had to carry water to feed, uh, to irrigate uh, the plants. And the pond where the water was uh, fetched uh, was far from uh, the location where the plants uh, were grown, so it was so difficult. And I could not uh, manage to follow, to comply with the plan. And for that, I was really criticized. Madame, je sais que c'est un peu difficile de répondre précisément à certaines de mes questions. Ma question était, qu'est-il arrivé à votre fils, Sinarit Je suis un peu difficile de répondre à certaines de mes questions, mais je dois vous dire que je suis un peu difficile de répondre à certaines de mes questions. Mon fils est malade à nouveau. Il a eu une diarrhée. And noting that uh, there nothing could cure his illness, I asked that he be admitted to Kanlian Hospital where he died. And I returned to the cooperative, and only my husband and I survived. Excusez-moi d'insister. Qu'est devenue votre petite sœur 
Excuse me for dwelling on this. What happened to your younger sister, please? Response. My younger sister also died after she had a kind of symptom that the whole body was swelling and she couldn't survive this ordeal. Son corps au complet a gonflé et elle n'a pas pu survivre. Lorsque vous étiez dans ce deuxième lieu, est-ce qu'il y avait place, une surveillance qui était exercée sur vous every evenings and I could Je also know that the members of other family also Et kept uh, disappearing every now and then and I was also told that I had to keep mum because uh, the wall has the ears. Car les murs, euh, avaient des oreilles. Est-ce qu'il y a eu des disparitions quand vous étiez dans ce deuxième lieu in the second place, did people disappear? At the second location, people disappeared uh, because the husband of my neighbor uh, was taken away and also a group of family members uh, were also taken away. And later on, it happened to me and my husband. You said that your husband was a London soldier, and you explained that after the first population transfer, Yorn told you to hide his profession and helped you hide his profession. Then later, lieu, and in Kochum, particular in the second place, Kochum, did the Khmer Rouge learn mari? what your husband was doing? Response. When I arrived at Chung property, I did not know why they learned about my identity and that of my husband. But uh, later on, I noted that uh, the security guards of the security center approached uh, my husband and kicked him repeatedly and asked him where he hid uh, his handgun. À répétition, ils ont demandé où as-tu caché ton pistolet. Est-ce que vous pouvez nous dire ce qui est arrivé à votre mari? Tell us what happened to your husband. No at that security center, my husband had been accused severely. I am a spouse uh, who uh, was accompanying uh, my husband. Uh, I only learned that he was detained uh, in a uh, detention facility where it was a complete darkness. Uh, and we were separated uh, forever until the day when my husband was executed. Est-ce que vous avez vous aussi personnellement Did été you, arrêté à cause de lui? Were you also arrested yourself because of him? Yes, I was uh, oui. because uh, my husband uh, was come, uh, implicated and accused. Uh, then I had to also be brought along with uh, my husband. However, I was not interrogated like my husband was because I uh, only was his spouse. I was allowed to 
work outside Donc, uh, at the cooperatives and ate uh, there, but my husband là-bas. didn't enjoy this. Mon mari, lui, uh, n'a pas he pu only was uh, given a full ladle of porridge and only a grain of salt for each a meal. C'était une louche de gruau et une pincée de sel. Lorsque vous avez été arrêté and aussi, arrested, et là où vous étiez, est-ce que well, vous avez constaté des disparitions ou des exécutions Uh, could you tell us, uh, please, in which location uh, where uh, disappearance happened? Uh, uh, please uh, repeat that uh, portion. Les disparitions se sont produites. Pouvez-vous répéter, je vous prie. Vous avez dit que votre mari you avait été arrêté et exécuté, et que vous avez été arrêté et conduit dans un centre. Est-ce que dans ce centre, in vous avez center, constaté des exécutions Response. The location was the place for execution. At that place, I was pushed C'était into a room and I was uh, terrified. It was incredible because the Terrifying. plates, uh, the bowls of, uh, that were used for serving rice were used to un, keep feces. En fait, excrement. il y avait des excréments dedans. And the, the stench was horrible. Le... And I was there to remain in the prison. I had to place my nose close to a small hole so that I could breathe uh, some oxygen. Then I then saw a soldier, a very young soldier, underage, armed with a rifle, came coming to ask for Comrade King. He accused Comrade King for stealing a grilled fish. And I had uh, to look at the way this uh, person was treated. I saw the young boy uh, hacked uh, the person stomach, uh, his internal organ was uh, coming out and he was stabbed with a bayonet. Uh, and I couldn't cry because I was so terrified that I would end up being killed like that. And I had uh, to remain in the vicinity and I had to work every third day of the week and uh, on that day, uh, those days, then a soldier would be coming to ask for a group of people, for example, a different age uh, group so that they could be sent to the zone. I did not know what zone was. I was uh, told that zone uh, is the place where Food was plentiful, on where we could have some fruit, like oranges, because we believed already that in Posad uh, it was plenty of uh, rice and oranges. And having heard that people could be taken to the zone, I asked that I be allowed to go to the zone, because I was hoping that I would be offered uh, enough food to eat later on. Uh, indeed, they did not allow me et, to go with them, m'a, and m'a it was fortunate partir. that I did. Et I was not allowed to go d'ailleurs. with them; otherwise, I could have Sinon, been executed already. So, the soldiers who always brought us uh, to work, uh, soldats, the soldiers ended up being the prisoners, the prisoners themselves at a later date, some of them. And uh, when we discussed about the execution and the guards who turned prisoners, say that indeed killing started 
even in 1975 and by 1977 about approximately indeed a hundred thousand people had already been executed and uh, people who disappeared and who believed to be sent to the zone were sent to be executed. And the clothes of the people who had been executed would be brought back to uh, the remaining people to use. So after that, I learned that indeed the zone was the place where execution took place and it was a blessing, a blessing for me indeed for not being allowed to go there. Thank you. To finish, I'm going to be asking you more gen general Quand questions. Phnom Penh, on vous a dit when que vous you were in Phnom Penh, Phnom Penh, you were told that you would return to Phnom Penh three, three to four days later. Que par la suite on vous a and later on, were you told why you would not return to Phnom Penh? Okay, Atma. Response, uh, I was not told and I did not ask them or dare not ask them. Having noted anyone disappearing or uh, someone die, we uh, did not have, uh, we did not dare ask them for any question which just worked and worked. Quand vous avez quitté Phnom Penh, on vous a dit que c'était à cause des bombardements Penh, qui risquaient d'arriver de la part des Américains. Quand vous avez quitté votre premier lieu de vie, on vous a dit so qu'on vous emmenait à Batambang parce qu'il y aurait beaucoup de riz et vous n'êtes pas allé à Batambang. Vous avez dit que les Khmer Rouges vous donnaient des prétextes pour vous emmener et qu'ils ne leur importaient pas de tenir parole weren't particularly interested avis, in keeping their word. La raison de But ces in your view, what was the real reason for all of these movements? I thought that the evacuation of the people from one place to another is to temper them. Because if they really told us that we had to relocate, then we would feel very uncomfortable that we had to leave our belongings behind. For that reason, they would tell us that we would leave only for three days. But we left for more than that, and then we had no hope that we would return. And for that reason, we tried to temper ourselves, to adhere ourselves to the Anka lines. And as a result, ten of my family members died, and only two remained. Seules deux personnes de ma famille sont de mort, et les autres sont mortes. Vous avez vécu l'évacuation de Phnom Penh, so le premier transfert un premier endroit où vous avez vécu dans des conditions que vous avez décrites, puis un deuxième transfert forcé, puis un autre endroit où vous avez décrit les conditions, puis le centre de rééducation où nous avez expliqué tout ça. Est-ce que, du fait de votre expérience vécue, est-ce que vous pensez que l'évacuation de Phnom et le transfert forcé faisait partie d'une d'un plan ou d'une politique plus générale des Khmer Rouges. I made my own analysis and I came to a conclusion that was truly the policy of the Khmer Rouge, they did not value a human being, 
n'accordait aucune and valeur so, uh, à la vie. Lines, and they are pour ce qui était leur progress forward. Ils n'ont pas aussi longtemps people. que leur encart progressait. Ils n'avaient que faire de la vie des gens. Ils n'avaient plein de vie et de médicaments, mais ils ne les ont pas donnés au peuple. For us, As long as we could live together with our families, we would uh, do our best uh, in doing the work. I tried to transform myself and I could even compete with the best people in transplanting rice. But they did not value us. Their intention was to eradicate us. So that new born people en fait, ils nous would éliminer. have new ideas based Toutes on their, their de thinking and the way they act during the time. Penser, la façon dont ils agissaient. Je vous remercie, Madame. Je n'ai plus de questions. Thank you very much, Madam. I have no further questions to ask you. And in a more general way, I would like to thank you for having made this rather difficult statement, which has given us some particularly useful elements for our file. Thank you, Madam, and thank you, Mr. President. Thank you. The floor is now given to the prosecution. Bonjour, Monsieur le Président, Mesdames et Messieurs. Good morning, Mr. President. Good morning, Your Honours. Good morning to all parties. Au public, dans la galerie, et bonjour à vous. And to the gallery and to all of you. Madame la partie civile, la bonne. And to you, witness. Nous allons vous poser des questions de suivi. We are going to put a few follow-up questions to you. Pas très nombreuses, mais je pense que nous irons jusqu'à la pause. But I believe this will take us to the morning break, Mr. President. Je voudrais simplement I préciser certaines choses avec vous. I like to clarify a few things with you. En repartant du, du 17 avril 1975. Starting from 17 April 1975. Uh, simplement au fin de and, clarification, est-ce que vous pourriez donner le nom de votre premier mari? Je crois que vous n'aviez pas donné le nom. Can you give us the name of your first husband? I don't think you gave us the name. Donc celui qui était officier supérieur, qui travaillait avec le Nol, était un officier qui était exécuté à Who was in the Lon Nol Army and who later on was executed. My husband's name was a Prat Sinat. He was born in 1948 in Pursat province. Thank you. So if I understood clearly what you said to us yesterday, you told us that your husband Prat Sinat did not take part in the battle against the Khmer Rouge in Phnom Penh. So, aside from that, Vu ou entendu le 17 avril 1975 que des combats avaient lieu dans Phnom Penh. Phnom Penh. I did uh, not know about that. What I knew was that the Khmer Rouge arrived in Phnom Penh and the shelling stopped. And we were jubilant and congratulated the victory of 17 April 1975 and that we would have peace. Effectivement, vous aviez dit ça également que hier vous étiez sorti dans les rues. Uh, that uh, you stepped out into the street uh, to congratulate uh, the victors uh, and to wave flags. La la que vous aviez, so, tout peur although you were delighted that the war was passé over, mari? were you afraid because of uh, your husband's military past? I was afraid because I heard that those people, during the time that the people were gathered to be soldiers and that they would devour people and take out the levers. So when I saw them dressing in black uniforms, I was afraid. Prenez leur foi, et donc quand j'ai vu ces gens habillés en noir, j'ai eu peur. Merci. Thank you. Alors, vous avez dit donc la foule, le, le, la population s'était massée dans les rues, applaudissait, euh, chantait, acclamait les Khmer Rouges. 
Je voudrais savoir du point de vue alors des Khmer Rouges, quelle so était la réaction des Khmer Rouges par rapport à cet Rouge, accueil de la foule Est-ce qu'ils ont célébré leur victoire avec la population ou bien ils étaient plus réservés, avaient une autre attitude que ça Je voudrais savoir du point de vue Attentive and vigilant. Ils étaient attentifs et vigilants. Although we, when we raise our nous avons levé les bras pour les féliciter et eux ont levé le bras à leur tour. Ils étaient attentifs et vigilants. Merci. Hier, Thank vous avez dit que you told les messages que vous aviez entendus des Khmer Rouges et maintenant des Khmer Rouges avaient été annoncés par voie de radio. Uh, Est-ce que vous pourriez préciser uh, si les Khmer Rouges, lorsque vous étiez dans la rue ou bien lorsque vous étiez déjà rentré à la maison, Rouge ont utilisé des porte-voix ou des matériels de sonorisation uh, pour communiquer leurs premières paroles ou les premières instructions à la population I heard once when I was at my house, but while we were en route, we did not hear à la maison. it. En chemin, je n'ai pas entendu There was no announcement from loudspeakers en route. En route, we il only avait heard they shouted that we had to leave immediately. Il criait simplement que nous devions quitter immédiatement. Merci. Et à propos Thank de you. cela, vous aviez dit que un soldat et deux autres étaient venus à votre maison et vous avez donné home, cet ordre de quitter la ville immédiatement. Est-ce que, à la suite de leur venue, vous avez décidé Following de quitter this, did you la ville directement ou vous avez pris un certain right temps away, pour rassembler vos affaires Ou est-ce que les Khmer Rouges eux-mêmes vous attendaient devant la maison pour être sûr de quitter you, uh, la, la maison home to make sure that you would be J'avais déjà des jours précédents. Le matin, we had just nous avons to, fait to cuire nous ourselves. devions juste préparer at the time de quoi manger. That the Soldiers came to Quand les soldats our house, sont they arrivés were animated, chez nous, and then ils étaient my agités. And my that we Mon mari et les leave. membres de ma famille ont décidé de partir. Did not go, we were that we would be Dans shot. le cas contraire, nous avions peur de nous faire tirer dessus. Merci. Thank Alors, you. ces soldats qui vous ont dit de so partir, est-ce qu'ils vous ont dit que vous partiez pour trois ou pour sept jours. Je crois qu'hier, vous avez mentionné for les deux. Est-ce que lors de ce premier yesterday. contact avec les Khmer Rouges, so le 17 avril, est-ce qu'ils vous ont mentionné trois jours ou bien sept jours Est-ce qu'ils vous ont mentionné trois jours ou bien sept jours Est-ce qu'ils vous ont mentionné trois jours ou bien sept jours Est-ce qu'ils vous ont mentionné trois jours ou bien sept jours Initially, we were told that uh, we would live only for three days or the longest seven days and that we did not have, have to bring much belongings. Et que nous and I thought the nous. same thing that Je me suis dit la même chose. how could uh, we go through the countryside without Je having sufficient uh, belongings. Aller à la so I believe them, I believe that, that, that we would only live for three days Donc, and the longest of seven days. So everybody then uh, just left. Jours, au maximum. Et c'est ainsi que tout le monde est parti. Vous avez dit que you told us vous deviez vous rendre à la campagne. Est-ce qu'ils ont dit exactement to où to vous deviez aller and they tell you exactly uh, where you à ce moment-là ou ce n'était pas clair or all this was not clear. No, they did not tell us specifically as where we had to go. Exactement où nous devions aller. What we were told was that we had to leave Phnom Penh. Ils ont dit que nous devions quitter Phnom Penh. And when we reached Monivong Boulevard near the Royal School of Law, it was so crowded. But at the back of the junction, there were various roads leading to various other directions, and the road became less crowded. Et donc, un peu à la fois, il y a eu moins de monde sur la route, mais ils, ont pas dit, ils ne nous ont pas dit exactement dans quelle direction nous devions nous engager. 
Est-ce que lorsqu'ils sont venus and à la maison, donc ces trois soldats Khmer Rouge, est-ce qu'ils vous ont dit s'il y avait des moyens de transport qui seraient mis à la disposition des, des habitants pour faciliter l'évacuation Ils ne l'ont pas dit. By Ils whatever nous ont means juste dit we had. de partir euh, en utilisant les moyens de transport que nous avions, quels qu'ils soient. Ils vous ont dit d'emporter peu so d'affaires. Ils vous, vous ont dit d'emporter quand même suffisamment de vivres, de médicaments, food, de matériel de couchage, or, or enough, uh, medicine, pour un voyage de 3 à 7 jours. Or enough, uh, sleeping materials for a 3 to 7 day trip. No, they did not tell us to bring non. this or that belonging. Ils ne nous ont pas dit d'emporter telles ou telles affaires. C'était à nous de décider But ce dont nous family, avions besoin au quotidien. Uh, Pour ma famille, nous n'avons pas emporté de riz car ça pesait trop lourd. Real nous n'avons emporté que de l'argent, des way. reals car nous pensions que nous pourrions utiliser cet argent en cours de route. Mais bien entendu, les Khmer Rouges ne vous avaient pas But dit course, au moment où vous partiez que cela ne servait à rien d'emporter de l'argent. C'est ça que useless, uh, to bring with you. No, they did not. Non, ils ne l'ont pas dit. While we were en route, we heard about that. Route, so we were, we became so nous avons entendu hopeless cela, that the money was no longer used. Et nous used. avons été désespérés d'apprendre que l'argent n'était plus en usage. Merci. Vous avez parlé Thank you. du prétexte you du bon, des bombardements américains. Je vais the excuse of the American bombings. And I'd like to return to this Lorsque point. Lorsque les soldats Khmer Rouge sont venus Khmer dans votre Rouge maison, arrived at your home. Lorsque vous avez Or vu d'autres soldats Khmer Rouge le long de la route, dans Phnom Penh et, et plus tard, tard est-ce qu'ils ont avancé d'autres motifs que les bombardements américains the American pour justifier l'évacuation et convaincre la population de quitter Phnom Penh rapidement et sans quickly, difficulté uh, and No, they did not tell anything besides that non, uh, ils n'ont rien the dit de tel. Ils ont juste dit And que course, les Américains we allaient bombarder la ville. So Bien sûr, nous avions peur des bombardements. Et donc, nous nous sommes empressés de quitter la ville. Merci. Vous avez déjà Thank dit you. que you les Khmer Rouges qui étaient venus chez vous étaient armés, que vous aviez été effrayés. Armed and you were frightened. Est-ce que leur attitude était And menaçante attitude à votre égard Ils ne m'ont pas menacé. Mon mari était en bas, ils les ont accueillis, ils étaient armés, ils étaient agités, et en voyant qu'ils avaient des armes, nous avions peur. Vous avez dit hier que l'ordre qui était donné de quitter la ville était ferme et que les Khmer Rouges étaient agités et déterminés. Est-ce que la façon dont l'ordre de quitter la ville a été donné given, et cette attitude des Khmer Rouges vous ont à un moment donné laissé penser que vous aviez le choix libre et entier de rester chez vous ou de partir No, uh, I did not think non, like that at that time. je n'ai pas pensé to go cela. Because we nous were devions so partir afraid of the American area bombardment. car nous étions terrifiés we par the damages from the les bombardements américains. Nous avions so we déjà vu les dégâts provoqués par des tirs et donc nous devions quitter. Est-ce que vous avez vu sur la route en quittant Did you see Phnom, Penh, along the road Phnom Penh dans les différents quartiers que vous avez traversés ou est-ce que vous auriez entendu that, uh, you que certaines personnes ont malgré tout essayé de discuter les ordres des Khmer Rouges d'évacuer la ville 
discuss the orders with the Khmer Rouge, the orders to leave the city. No, I did not uh, witness that non, personally, but my family members uh, saw that. Des membres de ma famille l'ont vu. They said that we had to just proceed ahead, and if we return, then we would be killed. Aller de l'avant, and of course, si I heard the gunshots. En arrière, nous nous ferions tuer. Moi, j'ai entendu des bruits de tir. Est-ce que vous avez vu des Dans la ville de Phnom Penh, en Phnom 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 I oui. was threatened vu cela. while en route. J'ai été At that time, I had a green color carry bag and I had some essential belongings, vert. including uh, money. J'avais and I carried it uh, with me fait. while I was uh, sitting J'avais on the track. It seems that the Khmer soldiers really despite the, 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 the soldiers and when they saw that a green bag, they pointed a gun at me and asked me to throw away the bag. I was shaken and terrified. So I pulled out J'étais my belongings terrorisé. and placed it on a J'ai piece of a scarf and I threw away that bag immediately. And if I didn't do that, I would have been shot. They really threatened me dessus. at the time to get menacé rid of ce that bag. Pour que je me débarrasse de ce sac. Je voudrais une clarification par rapport à ce que vous avez dit hier concernant les soldats de l'ONU qui étaient en uniforme, je crois. Vous avez dit que vous aviez vu certaines choses et que d'autres vous avaient dit que les soldats de l'ONU avaient été arrêtés en ayant les mains attachées dans le dos. Pourriez-vous préciser ce que vous ou votre mari avez vu ou ce que d'autres personnes vous ont dit à ce propos-là At that time, I did not see it, but my husband and family members saw them being arrested. So, from that point, from that point of view, we could see that they were really enemies. That is, the Khmer soldiers and the Lonol soldiers. If they noticed the ankles had the mat of, bear, of wearing boots, then they would be conclude that they were the soldiers and they would be arrested. En voyant des gens porter des bottes, les Khmer Rouges ont conclu que c'était des soldats et ils les arrêtaient. Et hier, vous avez donné un exemple d'un colonel, membre de votre belle famille, qui, à un barrage, avait été identifié comme militaire, et qui avait dit, qui avait dû, selon ce que vous avez dit, retourner à Phnom Penh pour y travailler. Savez-vous, avez-vous appris par la suite ce qui est advenu de ce colonel, de votre belle famille, après qu'il soit rentré à Phnom Penh At that time, the Khmer Rouge did not know that my other in-law was a colonel. When he left Phnom Penh, he went to stay at the Prague A. At that time, there was an announcement on the speaker that for any military officers, they should return to Phnom Penh to resume their work. Of course, uh, as a human being, we would have an ambition and we did not want to stay in the open. So upon hearing such an announcement, he prepared his belongings and returned to Phnom Penh. Donc après avoir However, cela, il a since the day he left, he disappeared. Départ, so we conclude that he was Nous en avons conclu killed by the Khmer Rouge.
Merci. Hier encore, vous avez dit que lors de la sortie de Phnom Penh, dans votre quartier ou les quartiers adjacents, vous aviez vu des cadavres, en tout cas que vous, votre mari, avez vu des cadavres dans les rues. Je voudrais savoir si ces cadavres que vous avez vus ou que votre mari a vus étaient-ils uh, des civils, habillés en civils ou habillés en militaires The bodies that I saw at Prague Pra commune were in civilian clothes. And I saw young children uh, bodies in the hammocks. Des cadavres de jeunes enfants so they dans were des simply civilians. I did not know for what reason that they were killed. Est-ce que vous avez vu d'autres cadavres avant d'arriver à la commune de Prague 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 dans la ville de Phnom Penh elle-même On the way, I saw one or two route, dead bodies. J'ai vu un ou deux cadavres. And by seeing dead bodies, I was afraid that if we did not follow their instructions, then uh, we would be killed Je by the Khmer Rouge. Si nous ne suivions pas leurs instructions, and we were very afraid les Khmer Rouge nous tueraient. Et au spectacle de ces cadavres, nous avons été terrifiés. Et donc c'est un ou deux cadavres so que vous avez vus. C'était des soldats en were uniforme ou bien des personnes civiles. Soldiers en civil. or were uh, the uh, bodies wearing civilian clothes? They were in uh, civilian clothes. Ils portaient des vêtements civils. Hier, vous avez mentionné qu'il y avait eu plusieurs barrages sur la route. Vous avez notamment mentionné celui de Chertal, où vous avez dit que vous ne pouviez plus avancer ni reculer. Pourriez-vous nous dire si vous avez été contrôlé à d'autres points de contrôle sur la route par des soldats Khmer Rouge At those uh, checkpoints where we were not allowed to proceed further and that we uh, were not allowed to cross uh, the checkpoint, we tried to escape from that place so that we could reunite with my uh, parents in Ksak Kandal district, Kandal district of Kandal province. De Kandal. <laughs> Aux différents postes de contrôle, est-ce que vous avez vu les Khmer Rouge so confisquer des biens Khmer aux différents évacués confiscate, uh, belongings uh, from the evacuees. Yeah, no, I did not see them non, confiscate anything. je ne les ai pas vus confisquer quoi que ce soit. We could carry our belongings, accept anything belonging through soldiers or military, affaires, then they would uh, point guns to those people and they would get rid of those military staff. Le matériel militaire, auquel cas, ce matériel était retiré aux gens sous la menace d'une arme. Vous avez fait la distinction entre peuple du 17 you avril et peuple de base. And à partir de quand avez-vous entendu qu'on vous appelait so, peuple du 17 avril uh, Est-ce que c'était déjà sur la route menant uh, à votre village uh, ou bien uh, c'était plus tard Or was it later? A rich Swai Protil village in Sam district, de Tropil, and I stayed there for uh, two weeks. And I contacted with the local people there, and they referred to themselves as the best people. And that we were called the 17 April people who were just de de base, evacuated from Phnom Penh. Merci. J'en viens alors Thank à you. votre Now, départ de Ksak Kandal. Now, I would like to turn to uh, 
your departure le from Sakandal when the village votre, chief told you to prepare your belongings to leave uh, to Batambang. what he said would be Batambang. Lorsque and, uh, ce chef de village qui s'appelait Pat vous avez préparé vos affaires, Pat asked you to prepare your belongings. Un ordre ou est-ce que vous pouviez discuter cette uh, mesure qui avait this, été décidée? Uh, It was an order. C'était un ordre. And also we thought that if we go to Badambol, it would be better because si uh, in Cambodia everyone was uh, very well aware that Badambol was a rich province. province. So we did not have even riche. a slight idea of a protest against going to Badambol. Cela ne nous est même pas venu à l'idée de protester contre la décision de nous emmener à Batambang. Lors de l'évacuation de Phnom Penh, on vous avait dit que vous partiez pour 3, 7 jours. Et finalement, ça faisait déjà à peu près un an que vous étiez à Sakandal et vous n'avez pas été autorisé à rentrer chez vous. Est-ce qu'au moment où le chef du village vous a dit que vous alliez à Batambang, est-ce que vous avez eu quelques doutes, malgré tout, sur la véracité de ce qui vous était dit Vous avez des questions sur la vérité de ce qu'il vous a dit At that time, I did not have any suspicion because at the second day, the, communi the commune chief told us that we should go because uh, then the food was uh, plentiful there. And at that location, there was not uh, enough food and there were too many people, so new families could not be uh, supported. And for that reason, we should leave. Subvenir à leurs besoins, raison pour laquelle nous devions partir. Merci. Thank you. Une dernière question, qui est une clarification. Which in vous avez dit fact que is tous les gens qui sont partis de Sakandal vers Pursat, donc qui ont été Pursat, emmenés uh, par différents moyens de transport, étaient des évacués ou des, des gens du 17 avril. Uh, Est-ce que l'ensemble de ces personnes, And vous avez mentionné environ uh, 200 personnes, est-ce que l'ensemble de ces personnes And sont restées dans les coopératives did à Pursat, ou bien certaines d'entre elles auraient continué par la suite vers Batambang. Or did Batambang. some of them uh, keep on going uh, with their journey to Batambang? I did not know much about that because I only knew that when we reached the Kortium cooperative, c'était qu'arrivé à la coopérative de Promptium, nous sommes restés là. C'est tout ce que je savais. Merci. Et dernière question. Thank you. And last question. En arrivant à la coopérative, when you arrived at the cooperative, est-ce que euh, sur place vous avez été interrogé au sujet de votre parcours, about your past? au sujet de votre passé Est-ce que vous avez dû rédiger une biographie Were you obliged uh, to draft a biography No, they did not uh, question no. us, but we were put into various uh, groups and units, and we were asked what we did in Phnom Penh or what business we were engaged in, but we were not asked to write a biography. On ne nous a pas demandé de rédiger une biographie. Et est-ce que là encore, comme and vous l'aviez déjà fait auparavant, est-ce que vous avez donc before, mentionné que votre mari Did était chauffeur de taxi that your husband, uh, had been a cab driver? Yes, I told them that my oui, husband was a Lambretta driver. Que mon mari était un chauffeur de Lambretta. Merci beaucoup, Madame la Partie civile, d'avoir répondu very much, à mes questions. Je uh, crois que mon collègue party. a quelques questions également um, à vous poser. Je pense que mon collègue peut avoir quelques questions à vous poser avant la pause de la matinée. Uh, Merci encore. Thank you. Bonjour, Monsieur le Président, Mesdames, Messieurs les Juges. Good morning.
Madame Sivopati. Bonjour, I only Madame have a few supplementary Je n'ai que to quelques questions you. supplémentaires à vous poser. I want to know that when people were evacuated from Phnom Penh, quand les gens ont été évacués de Phnom Penh, was there any family or anyone who requires not to leave Phnom Penh? Did they have such a choice of not leaving Phnom Penh? Ont demandé de rester à Phnom Penh. Une telle option de rester à Phnom Penh existait-elle? I did not know réponse. about that at that time because I did not think about other rien. people. Je I was busy autres. thinking about my Je family members. So I did not know whether any family Je requested uh, si not to leave Phnom Penh. Avait à à Question. Question. When there were arrests of people or the former Lonol soldiers, lorsque des gens ou des anciens were soldats business, de Lonol uh, ont été too? arrêtés, uh, arrest, uh, des hommes d'affaires aussi ont general, été arrêtés. Response. As I knew. All Lonol soldiers would be arrested if they were suspicious of being Lonol soldiers. Seraient arrêtés si on les soupçonnait d'être des soldats de Lonol. Question: What about ordinary Question. civilians or business people? Des civils ordinaires were they also ou des arrested? Ont-ils également été arrêtés? Response. Let me uh, speak a little bit on this Réponse. matter. As for the ordinary civilians, Pour while I was at the tempering office, I learned that not only soldiers had been arrested, but civilians were also arrested, as they were alleged of being capitalists or feudalists or those who sold goals at the market in Phnom Penh. So while I was in that office, I learned that from all walks of life, people had been arrested. Question. Question. Before the commencement of the evacuation of people from Avant Phnom Penh, le début de was there de Phnom Penh? an announcement on the radio, or was there any word from mouth to mouth regarding the planned evacuation? Est-ce que le plan d'évacuation? Response. No, I did not learned in advance that there would be an evacuation, oreille, but they non, came to us uh, promptly and that we had to leave uh, in the wake of the American bombardment. bombardment Question. Question. During the period that you stayed at the location where you had been evacuated to, there were Criticism meetings, as you said. What was the intention of such a meeting, and who actually led that meeting? De critique et d'auto critique, d'après ce que vous avez dit. À quoi servaient ces réunions et qui les dirigeait? The criticism meeting was led by the group and the deputy, the group chief and deputy group chief. The purpose was for people to criticize anyone who was a member of the group who made a mistake. Most people would be able to deny or to protest any criticism, but for us, the 1700 people, we kept silent and just tried to commit ourselves to refresh ourselves and try to not make mistake again. Et d'éviter de commettre d'autres erreurs. When you and other people who had to sell Anka and then fell ill, how were you treated when you got sick? Comment étiez-vous traité une fois que vous étiez tombé malade? Response. If we got ill, for example, practically, if it was obvious that we got diarrhea or vomiting and people saw this, then we could have a rest, but uh, we couldn't afford to be sick because other would 
say that, uh, that we malade. pretended to be sick and they would look at us sinon, in a str- they will give a strange look at us when Et we did so question on nous regardait bizarrement what did you question. do uh, what did people do in the cooperatives Et que faisaient les gens dans la cooperative response at cooperatives response. During dry season, we would be asked to dig canal to keep water for irrigation for for paddy fields. And during the rainy season and the farming season in particular, we were asked to transplant rice, to build the dikes, and so on and so forth. Question. Could you also tell Question. the chamber, please, concerning the correction center or the security center where your husband Celui was detained? For example, the Takaul correction center or other center. What kind of torture was uh, being inflicted on the prisoners there? The president, uh, civil party, could you please hold Madame on Madame counsel for Mr. Ian Sari? You on your feet. You will may not proceed. Counsel, Angodam. Thank you, Mr. President, Merci, and Président. thank you, Your Honours. Very good morning Merci to my learned colleagues. I take issue with this question because it relates to the security centers. These security centers uh, are not relevant to document, e document E124. E124. Co prosecutor, Mr. President. This morning, the civil party testified about the security center and the place where her husband was detained and tortured. I would just like to ask her the techniques of torturing, and I would like to know more about how her husband was treated under detention. I would like Au her to answer to this question. The president, uh, president, the objection is well reasoned and therefore sustained. The national co-prosecutor is not allowed to put questions that stray out of the scope of the facts being at issue here. We are now Déjà focusing on the procès. immediate evacuations of uh, Phnom Penh and Phnom the city, so the questions urbains. shall always be framed to donc vous go straight to these particular areas. The civil party is somehow entitled with the right uh, to civile express her suffering de faire une in the scope of case file 002 slash 01 and after such expression of suffering parties will be offered the opportunity to address a few points if they wish so please do not dwell on the same problem Question. Since uh, we're running out of time, I would Nous like to ask uh, just a few final Comme questions. De temps, you talked about the hardship, the difficulties you encountered during the evacuation. Can you please describe to the chamber all these uh, hardships? Were they different? I endured uh, hardship. I used to be raised in Phnom Penh. I never got used to hard labor. I had just delivered my baby for a few days, and when I was evacuated, I had to be separated Quand from separated from my family members ma and again after giving a baby my health 
was not good. Uh, and I could see other people had to give birth uh, midway. Some people had to be pushed uh, uh, on a hospital bed because they were seriously Et sick. And I could see elderly people who had to be walking. Uh, without proper destination. So everyone who left de uh, the city had a lot of difficulties and these difficulties were also shared uh, by the people at the local area. Et dans les, uh, the prosecutor, aussi, thank you very much, uh, civil party, for your responses and I thank you, Mr. President and your honors for this opportunity. The president, thank you, council, and thank you, civil party. It is now appropriate time for adjournment. Uh, the chamber will adjourn and the uh, court officer is now instructed to assist the civil party during the adjournment and uh, have her return by 11 a.m.